as a, as a leader in sport or across several organizations. Um, started off in Paralympic sport, of course, and then branched out into working with incredible national team athletes from Olympic, Paralympic, Commonwealth Games, uh, and other national teams at, at Athletes Can. So I'm, I'm just always looking for a chance to be involved in sport. And so when the, the chance for co-chef uh, de mission uh, came up, I, I knew it was for me. And I, I wanted the chance to really uh, celebrate the games because the, the games is what really drives all of us. When I saw um, the call for co-chef de mission for Santiago in Paris, I knew it was for me. I, I just knew right away. I was like, oh, I have to do this. And the reason being is that I had a very, very long uh, career as an alpine ski racer, Paralympic alpine ski racer. I competed at three games, I won eight medals, uh, you know, world titles, all sorts of stuff. Um, I had a wonderful, wonderful experience, but I also had everything else you can imagine in between horrific crashes, um, difficulties with coaches, difficulties with teammates, uh, doubts, uh, major injuries, um, all sorts of things, the whole gamut through a long sporting career. So it was really, it's like life, you know, it was ski, skiing was life. It was crazy and amazing. Um, and I really feel uh, not only that, is something that I can bring to the table, but also I worked at Sport Canada for a number of years. I currently work at Game Plan, at, which is Canada's holistic athlete wellness uh, program that uh, provides services to Paralympians and Olympians. Um, so I have been involved in sport in a number of ways for a very, very long time. And it just seemed like the perfect fit for me. I really want to do everything that I can to build an environment at Team Canada where there's sport pride, Canadian pride, and disability pride. And Santiago and Paris and our team is a disability space. It's a disabled space. And we should be proud of that. And it's it's also whatever other space that team members are wanting it to be to, to live their authentic selves, because that is how we're going to get authentic performances, which are incredible performances. So that's a sort of a summary of, uh, of how I'm, I'm thinking that I want to approach some goals for the team. And I can't wait to be pushed and challenged and inspired by uh, Carolina's goals as well. And I think we're going to come together and create a beautiful team. So thanks, Josh, for mentioning that. In terms of my goals as co-chef, um, right now I'm just in the, you know, in that phase where people uh, wonder what is a co-chef, what does what does a co-chef do, and so I often divide the role into two halves. One is the critical half of being internal facing, so towards Canadian athletes, Canadian coaches, Canadian support staff, whether that's the massage therapist, physiotherapist, sports psychologist, equipment technician, whatever. All of those people are part of Team Canada and are there to bring out amazing performances in our athletes. And I'm so proud to be among those people. The second part, in my mind, is very much outward facing. So dealing with Many of the things that I, when I was an athlete, had no idea were going on. I had no idea that the chef de mission did these things. And in fact, this whole idea of co-chef, it's the first time, was put forward by the Canadian Paralympic Committee Athletes Council, because when they learned on kind of the laundry list of things that a, sh a chef de mission does, they were like, oh, Maybe we could use two people. It's, it's going to be incredible. It's going to be a performance advantage. And uh, it's, uh, you know, for the team. And then it's going to make our jobs uh, easier and more fun as well to be working together. So I, I, I can't wait to work together with Carolina leading up and on the ground. I mean, we're going to be pushing and pulling each other and reacting to each other. We're going to agree on a lot of things and disagree on some things. And that's 
where the advantage is. So we want to chase after that advantage. We are two great minds. There's no doubt about that. Two great Paralympic bodies and two big beating proud Canadian hearts. And we're gonna we're gonna lead lead Team Canada. And I think Josh and I are equally proud. And um, and we're also there to really support and do what needs to be done.